Hi guys, it's Elena and I'm enchanted to have you be here on my channel. Hello and welcome. I'm glad you're here. If you're new, consider liking, subscribing, becoming part of my YouTube family. We have tons of magical fun here. And if you've been here before, hello and welcome back. I'm super glad all of you guys are here. Hopefully your Friday night is doing good if you watch it on the day that I post it. Otherwise, well, hopefully any day that you're watching it is good. As you can see by the title down below, we are doing another Lunarly unboxing and I'm really excited about this one. I did end up unfortunately seeing a couple spoilers on Facebook, but that's okay. I don't know like the exactness of it, I just kind of know like the general-esque necessity of what it is, so I'm still going to be pretty surprised. Alright, so Lunarly is a monthly subscription box where they send either a candle or a plant, it alternates between the months, and it's a self-care box kind of curated around the new moon. So they send this box to you before the new moon starts so you can have things to work with for intentions with the new moon. Pretty darn. Oh, something smells nice and sweet in here probably the candle. Since we have a short box today, it's definitely a candle. And I just realized that I have over a year of Lunarly unboxings on my YouTube and that's pretty cool. It's called dedication to Lunarly <laughs> right there. Now I'm not sponsored by any means at all. This is just me purchasing it with my own money. And well, I really enjoy this subscription box. So. The candle is packed super nice and tight inside. That's what the packaging looks like. I took it out. I'm going to find out about it later. I think that's what smells good. I'm not entirely sure. I'm getting like a hint of like sweetness and licorice. All right, so not only do they send a plant or a candle, but they also send a crystal and other goodies to help with self-care and intention setting. And I love the boxes that they send them in. Each month it's the same exact box. I collect them and use them for storage because they're just like so good for storage. Okay, this is what the box inside looks like. It is nicely packed. Ooh, that's pretty artwork. This is for the blue moon. And it says, get ready because once in a blue moon is happening right now. Blue moons occur when there is more than one full moon in a month. That makes this an especially potent time for setting intentions. Welcome the power it brings and your efforts will be rewarded. An intention to inspire. I am powerful. I can do what I set my mind to. Which is awesome. I'm going to bring this a little bit closer. The artwork is beautiful. I like to keep these cards and place them right on my altar. On the back, it has information of all the moon dates for the upcoming month. Yay! So the reason why it's saying it's a blue moon is because October has two full moons. That's pretty cool. Alright, so inside this box, they also send a little pamphlet that explains all the goodies that we have. I'm going to read about it towards the end of the video and, well, let's dig in what we have in here. We have an empty little bag. I assume this is from the pendulum. Ooh, that's a pretty pendulum. Very nice. I like how it's fairly short, how this isn't like too long. And I definitely am liking the chakra colors over here. So it should be a really good pendulum to work with. Um, I'm going to guess this is tiger's eye, but I could be wrong. We'll see what the little pamphlet says. And well, this is the very pretty pendulum that we have. I'm gonna put my hand behind there. Very pretty. I do really like it. All right, on to the other goodies inside. And we have, what are you? Joy Wellness Spray. How do you shake well before and during use, miss above head and inhale deeply through the nose. Use on pillows, linens, ideal for the office, car, or airplane. Hmm. It is packaged quite nicely. Kind of. I'm still able to unscrew it though. Oh, this smells... Oh, 
how can I describe it? I'm not a big fan of it. It's citrusy. Uh, what is that drink? Sunny D. If you have ever had Sunny D, like, it's like a juice. It's like an orange kind of juice drink. This smells like it, except a little bit more herby or like earthy in the undertones. But like the initial whiff smells exactly like Sunny D, like the juice my mom did not let me drink when I was a kid. <laughs> That would be interesting to gift to someone who would enjoy it a lot more than I will. I'm not entirely a big fan of this smell. Alright, what else? In this little baggie is the crystal for the month. I'm looking inside. I know I know what that is and I want to open it and look at it, but I also don't know what the crystal is for this month. Ooh, that's pretty. has like little sparkles not entirely sure what this is um let me see if I can maybe put this behind it there's like little red shimmers in it tiny tiny bit it's a fairly flat piece uh, if I were to guess maybe a Jasper red Jasper I'm not entirely sure I like to guess these crystals even though I get them wrong most of the time. And let's see. Yes. Now this is the spoiler that I have seen. I knew there was a pendulum board and a pendulum in itself. So I knew what these were. But I'm excited to really see all the details and take a closer look at it. Oh, it's made out of really good material. I'm gonna toss that out. It's like a velvety canvas almost. Oh, it's double lined and embroidered. Ooh, this is some good quality pendulum board. Very nice. It has, let me see. Best way to show it to you is kind of like that. I'm gonna go over it. It has numbers on here it has days of the week it has no and yes it has rephrase and maybe and it has the zodiacs around there so this could be a very useful board to use and it's quite nice the material of it is like really sturdy it's i think it's velvet and then lined with something else too keep it flatter and keep it down. That's really good quality board. I'm really excited about it. It's beautiful. It's a really good size too. If you want to either use it at home, keep it as a permanent board or for travel. Nice. So that will be fun to play with. That'd be very fun to play with. I have a pendulum of my own. It's like my favorite and it's this like open, uh, how do I describe it? It's like this metal work case so that you can open it and put like little crystals or herbs or anything like that in it and then use it as a pendulum. I just love, love that pendulum. Okay, now on for the candle. I think this is what has been smelling, what I've been smelling in the box. No, I'm not sure. Maybe it was a mix of those two, but this smells like coffee. Mmm. Smells more like a coffee cookie or like a coffee donut. So it's not, it has that like caffeine, but it also has that sweetness of like a sugar cookie a little bit. Oh, it smells so good. I'm not a coffee person. I definitely prefer tea over coffee, but I do enjoy the smell of the coffee. Oh, that smells really, really good. I'm just gonna keep sniffing it. Mmm, it has some sort of almost minty undertone hmm I'm not sure all right so this is what's been in the box let's read about all the little goodies so we have a six-sided seven chakra tiger's eye pendulum very nice 
Description, a pendulum is an ancient tool used to connect with your spirit and guides. Usually those working with the pendulum would think of a question, state it out loud, and wait for the pendulum to swing yes or no depending on the direction. Instructions, hold the chain between your thumb and index finger and allow the tiger's eye pendulum to hang centered above the surface of your pendulum mat. State your question out loud and wait for the pendulum to swing. Very nice. And we have velvet pendulum mat. Description, this velvet pendulum mat has all the answers, you just need to ask the questions. The mat includes response options like yes, no, maybe, numbers, days, and astrological signs. Instructions, hanging the pendulum centered above the mat, take a few calming breaths and begin to ask your questions. Nice! Ooh, the stone is red jasper! I'm getting better at guessing these things. Description, red jasper is ready to be your rock. Okay, obviously it is already a rock, but as a stone known for offering a sense of stability. Red jasper can be a source of comforting support. Connect to the stone when you need to feel grounded. Red jasper is a really good grounding and balancing stone and it also helps with procrastination. <laughs> Instructions. Find a seated position on the ground, holding the red jasper in your hand. As you breathe in and out, visualize your root chakra becoming one with the earth. Allow yourself to feel stronger and more balanced in your foundation. Nice! And then we have the natural, naturally vain joy spray. Description, sometimes happiness finds us and sometimes we seek it out. On the days when you need an extra boost, reach for this bottle of joy. Filled with energizing scents like yang yang, lemon, and tangerine, a spritz of this spray is sure to perk you up. Instructions, use the spray in your environment to fill the space with stimulating aromas. Spray directly onto pillows, linens, in your office, or wherever you need a lift. Smells like Sunny D. <laughs> All right, and then we have the candle, and it's coffee, cinnamon, and cardamom. Oh, I think cardamom is that like earthy minty smell that I smell underneath. And let's see, it says, allow the spice notes of this warm and inviting candle to invoke your passions. The cinnamon scent is meant to foster a feeling of safety while the coffee bean aroma implores you to seize the day. Light it, take a deep breath, and ask yourself what you're ready to change. And then it has meditation tip and all, a little bit more information about the candle. So here are all these wonderful goodies. I'm really excited about this pendulum mat. I was actually in the process of making my own pendulum board. That's going to be a video later to come. But this will be a nice start to work with. Alright, so these are all the goodies and I want to leave you with a little bit of an information or news. So every new moon and every full moon, I'm going to be going live on my Instagram just to do a small little ritual with my friends and followers who want to join me. And if you want to send in any intentions for me to incorporate on the new moon and full moon, you are welcome to do so. I'll link the Instagram down below somewhere over here. All right, well, this is it. Hopefully you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to like, subscribe, the whole shebang, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.